what's going on everybody so we just got in the house not too long ago um i'm about to clean up and prepare for tomorrow because tomorrow is the day that we go to a theme park with sophia i'm super excited um but i'm also kind of nervous because having to deal with sophia or just kids you know toddlers her age um they're so unpredictable so you never know you will like think that they're gonna have a grand time and then you get there and then they like I don't want nothing to do with none of this and it is like the most annoying thing especially as a parent after you pay money for something and they're just like not interested but uh it is what it is um so i'm about to prepare for tomorrow but yes we had a great day today i have not been filming um none of this stuff i don't know if i explained it not that any of y'all probably care or whatever but just in case somebody do somebody wonder why you ain't showing this um, I just been really trying to be in the moment of everything. I really needed a break and this is just like on a personal level and I just feel like it's hard for me because I'm like this is my thing like YouTube is my thing so I don't really have any help with like filming and stuff like that so it's kind of hard to be in the moment and to film is really 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 tough like today it was tough maneuvering in the aquarium with a stroller so can you imagine me trying to vlog okay so yeah um so i just felt like it was best for me to just actually take a break from everything and not constantly be like let me try to get this footage and i gotta go home and i gotta edit this because i need to get footage for the next day so i don't know if we're gonna film tomorrow or not at the theme park um just because i feel like it's going to be on a much grand scale than it's been lately so if anything i probably would have had a better chance of filming is this stuff than the um amusement park and stuff like that so yes yeah, so just enjoy the rest of the clips i don't know what they're gonna be because i don't know what y'all gonna see what we're gonna film what we're not gonna film but i appreciate y'all for watching either way i don't even think i got that much space up here see how long it'll allow me to vlog you about to get ran over i had to come to target i knew i should have went to that walmart not the other walmart Anyways, we had to come to Target to get Sophia some saline drops and some Gatorade because she is officially sick now, which sucks. Sick baby on our hands. So, I had to go to the store earlier and I didn't know that they had this, but they have like the Kleenex wipes. So, I got these instead of getting boogie wipes because... I was a little iffy about boogie wipes before. I mean, it's cool, but you don't really get a lot, and the wipes are like really small. I guess it's good, like if your child is like smaller or whatever. Anyways, yeah. So I went to Target, and then I got some more lotion. Lotion. Oh, I'm tired. I got some more Kleenex, and then I got this one with the lotion. This is like the best kind, but then this one has Vicks on it. So I got three of those as you can see and then we had to get her some more filters for her nose thing so yeah get that pedialyte what else did i get um i got like this little like this cheese it kind of like cheese it trail mix because she likes that and um i can't remember what else did i get i think that's all that i got from the store so um oh and then i got her a cute pair of like shoes and another pair of uh, pajamas which y'all know like i can never stay out of the clothes section the shoe section at target so that was good that worked out um and then deontay just left back out to go back to target because the shoes that i got her is too small so he went to go exchange that then go to walmart pick up some lotion for her that i forgot to get when i was out and another filter for the humidifier um and the little filter inserts because we have like the vix one so put y'all down y'all hear my baby you okay we've been wiping her nose like every two seconds it's the most annoying thing She's been doing that too. The cold has been coming up, which is a good thing. It's like, that's what all of that is. Oh. Now prepare it. <coughs> Yo, 
You okay? I just threw the. <laughs> I appreciate you trying to cover your mouth, baby. And then, guess what she's been saying lately? Thanks to Deontay. She's been saying, oh crap. Cause that's his thing. Everything is oh crap, oh crap. And I'm like, don't say that in front of her because she is a parrot. Ah, 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 ah. She's a parrot nowadays. Like, it's like she turned three and she just says everything. And sure enough, as she's like, throwing up because he's saying oh crap when she throws up she's like oh crap once she got it all out what's going on y'all so i am currently watching shark week i just put sophia to sleep she's knocked out i'm about to put another um vix pad in this humidifier but i wanted to come in and tell y'all uh what's been going on with sophia so um <clears throat> Last night, today Sunday by the way, last night we had a pretty rough night with her. Um, she was having a tough time. She coughed all night. It was just really, really bad. And um, I just remember thinking to myself like, okay, she's gonna have to go because that was basically like, so that was basically like my my limit i need to put some more water in this anyways so that was like my limit last night i was like you know if she doesn't start feeling better you know i'm gonna have to take her to the doctor because she's had a fever since friday so um so yeah so got up this morning took her to patient first um just because it didn't really make any sense to deal with like going to like the er and all that stuff or whatever Took her to patient first, and they ran some x-rays, and she has pneumonia. Um, so, I am very bothered by it. I mean, I think as a parent, you never want your kids to be sick, period. But when you hear pneumonia, you, you know, get scared. You know, there has been, you know, people that have died from that. So, definitely is not something that you take lightly. Um, and you know, I started blaming myself because I started feeling like I didn't do enough to prevent her from getting sick. And I understand that you can't stop your kids from getting sick. I know what happens, you know, from being a parent for three years, I'm well aware that it's but so much that I can do. But you know, to me, I was just too relaxed at a place that I was so against, which is Chuck E. Cheese, because it's like you know germ city you know they don't wash that stuff down wipe it down sanitize it, all that stuff so i should have been on it like how i'm used to i should have been washing her hands and sanitizing her hands and just making sure that i did my part and i just kind of feel like i was just a little bit too lax and you know part of that was because i'm typically like that and i just wanted her to just have fun i wanted her to be a kid and i didn't want to you know, but I just wish that I would have done that. And then even if this was the results, at least I would have felt like, well, you know, I did everything I could do. She got sick. But at the same time, you know, after talking to like my family and stuff, they were telling me, you know, it's nothing that I could have done. You know, she's not used to being exposed to those germs. So her body was just like going crazy, you know, so it just it kind of is what it is. So. 